Hey guys, my name is Juan. I am a senior at Central Guinea High School. After graduating this year, I plan to go to college and study diesel mechanics. The reason I chose diesel mechanics is because since I was younger, I always enjoyed watching videos on how people take engines apart and rebuild them. And it always made me want to be able to do that to my own cars and truck. Um, my hobbies don't have a lot. I like playing sports, so soccer and basketball mainly, and lifting weights. But another hobby, I wouldn't really call it a hobby. It's my job. It's working in construction. Construction has really helped me and educated me in a lot of real world situations because it's hard labor work and it really teaches you a lot that you need to know when you're older. And I feel like it would help me um, in my future career because I want to be a decent mechanic. So, because they're both balanced out as uh, pretty much heavy labor work. One thing that I can't call one of my hobbies is reading. Reading has changed throughout my life. In elementary school, I really enjoyed it. I really liked going to the library and checking out books and reading them. When I got towards the beginning of middle school, I started to dislike it. And throughout middle school, I just really didn't like it at all because I would find other things to do that I enjoyed more. And that was when reading started to get more challenging because I would have to read harder books and I really didn't like reading as much to force myself to read a book. So that's probably why I didn't really like it. But till I got to high school, my senior year, that's when I, or this year, that's when I really started to get back into books and start reading at a consistent, more of a consistent pace than I was in the past years. It's mostly because Ms. Harper has really encouraged me to read and yeah, read because it has, it helps you in pretty much everything that you want to do in life from going to college, your test, just everything in life that it, it just helps you read. Especially this year, it's really helped me increase my uh, test grades. My test grades have from first semester to the second semester, they really increased just because of reading. Um, it helped me stay on topic and i um, really been able to just re read it and not really doze off as much as I used to because I learned different reading strategies that helped me stay concentrated on the same thing throughout the whole book and not go and like think about this, like think about a totally different thing while I'm reading the book. And that's just what, how, that's just one of the ways how reading really helped me just, just by reading. A book that I'm reading right now, uh, I found it in Miss Harper's room. Uh, it's called Earthrise. The book is is very interesting, and it's it really I actually enjoy I'm actually enjoying reading it. I haven't finished it, but I really do want to finish it before the school year ends. The, the book is is fictional, so it's not really it's never really happened before, but. The, how the book is explained and how it's written it has so much details that it, it makes you feel like the event actually happened and they're just telling the story about the book or about the event that happened in the book which is really interesting how how you can go into so how you can really go into depth just by um writing words and the book it's about how aliens take over the world and wipe out half of the human population and they enslave the other half that they didn't really kill which is like probably never going to happen but it's 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 actually really well written because it talks about how the 
the aliens have like they have this mentality that if you do what they what they tell you to do they won't kill you and the humans they have to do what pretty much what the aliens are talking telling them to do because they'll they'll pretty much die if they don't listen one thing that i would recommend to my children is to consistently read because consistently reading really helps you especially because i feel like everybody at one point of their life will dislike reading or they would just straight up hate it because they don't enjoy it as much as they used to but if you consistently read and you don't always have to enjoy it but if you just consistently read reading will be so much easier because in throughout all high school you will have to read especially the language arts test and each year they were just gonna get long longer passages harder questions and the better you are at reading the easier they are so if you're like a consistent reader it'd pretty much be easier because you have all these reading skills that you adapted all over the years by just reading pretty much compared to if like me uh, I stopped reading so I didn't really and I didn't really obtain these skills because I didn't read at a consistent rate I stopped reading but reading will help you in the future and everything everything you you need in life it will help you it's just a big part of life that everybody should always do no matter what no matter if they enjoy it or not and yeah